Welcome back. The Florida legislature has secured nearly $2 million in funding for mental health first aid training here in South Florida. And this will fund the work of West Palm Beach based Alpert Jewish Family Service, a really big deal. Here to talk more about how JFS is working to help with those mental health challenges, Cindy Whitus, mental health first aid director. And you know, we talk a lot about mental health these days, but knowing how to train someone to react in a situation, what an important tool. And now now you have funding to continue the program you already have and to expand it. Yes, it's great news. We're so, so very excited. Mm -hmm. So mental health first aid teaches the community how to recognize signs and symptoms to help that person who might be experiencing a crisis or might be developing a mental illness. It gives them the tools to help be that first response. For people not familiar with the Alpert Jewish Family Service, can you please share yeah, what you guys sure. do for our community? Sure. So we're a social service agency here in West Palm Beach and our whole mission is to help those through challenging times. We have 28 different programs. Mental Health First Aid is just one of them mm -hmm. and we are here to help. We have an information and referral line where you can actually talk to a real person and get the help that you need. So if someone watching right now is interested in getting the training, who is it specifically for and how can they get involved? So Mental Health First Aid was written for the community member. It's for our police force, our community members, our clerks at and check out people at Publix. Oh. It's anybody that lives in the community. Our goal is to make a safer community mm -hmm. for all of us to live in. And so, it, you know, perhaps it's someone watching that owns a business where you do deal with people from all walks of life. This is who you, you reach out to you guys and you guys can provide them some direction on how to train employees. Right. We will come. We have met and worked with 100 HR directors in 100 days just here in Palm Beach County. And with this new legislature that just went that we secured the funding for, we can expand to several different counties. We have trained over 10,000 people wow. in Palm Beach County, and our goal is 12,000 in just one year in the surrounding counties, oh. counties, even though, even as far as Tampa. That's amazing. And yeah. you know, what can you tell us a little bit about mental health and the awareness well, that our community has, um, really has picked up? Yeah, it has, and I'm so glad to see that because when we started this about eight years ago, the stigma was so much greater then. Sure. And now we're getting the word out by training all of these folks, talking to doctors, talking to our legislature, talking to everybody around, that it's just like any other illness. Mm -hmm. Mental illness is just like a physical illness. Uh, here's some things that you guys talk about. I, I'm assuming risk factors and warning signs. You understand how to look for those information about depression, anxiety, trauma, substance abuse. And then you talk about a five-step action plan to help in a, yes. in a crisis. Yes, this is Algae, A-L-G-E-E, -E, and he represents our five-step action plan okay. where we actually learn how to listen non-judgmentally, how to reassure versus give advice, mm -hmm. and how to assess the situation to make sure it's safe for you to approach as well as their safety. So we practice lots of skills during the class. I invite everybody to take it. I'm hoping it's going to be as popular as CPR and first aid in every business and every community worldwide. I think that's a really interesting way to put it and I think that's fantastic because yeah. we do need to be more aware and accepting and understanding and know how to handle certain situations. So thank you, thank you. for all you're doing and if you're watching out there and you're interested to learn more more about this mental health aid and how you can get involved or perhaps get some of your employees involved, you can go to our website. We put a link to theirs on ours at WPBF.com. So go check it out. Thanks for being with us, Cindy. Thank we you. appreciate it. Thank